Hey there, YouTube. What's up? Surreal Canine here with more Disgaea Dimension 2. In the last episode, we gave Grosso a beating. Uh, he went to his mysterious lair and uh, found out that some angels were up to something. But that doesn't matter right now. Uh, also in the last episode, we met a little angel little girl named Sicily who wants to be the Overlord and called Laharl Big Brother. Now, I don't think Laharl has a, uh, network of, uh, has an intelligence network set up anywhere, so we're going to have to see what she meant by that. We got some treasure chests now that we have started episode two, and all the vassals have something new to say. <laughs> These guys just do not care about Laharl at all. Whoops. Pretty book. That's nice, I guess. Eric is about to go to the library. Let's see here. Still don't have any way to ditch Etna. Zombie has nothing new to say. None of these guys seem to have anything new to say. Our party members, I mean. An item that steals magic. Yeah. By magic, I'm pretty sure they're not referring to magic skills. <laughs> I do save my game. Come on, game. Let's get serious here. <laughs> so yeah, let's see. We can adjust the cheat shop a little bit. Uh... I think that'll work for now. We probably don't want to adjust our uh, our EXP and mana too much because then they won't learn any of the other stuff that we actually do kind of need. A nailed bat. Let's see, that's a rare item. Uh, so yeah, let's have Laharl equip it. Boom. Oh, it looks like, uh... Oh, okay. <laughs> it's just the nailed bat that has an int penalty, I guess. Uh, let's see here. Yeah, Etna can equip a better spear. Okay, I guess I guess that's fine. We've got plenty of cash, so uh, now about we get some new weapons for ourselves. Did I talk? Yeah, I talked to you already. Tch. <laughs> <laughs> Padding your height, Laharl. How dare you? Tip of the day. Yeah, okay. That's pretty nice. Let's see here. Now that we are in episode two, we can buy some better stuff. I think. Unless that came from passing a, a more items bill. I don't quite remember. Hmm. Can afford two weapons. Yeah, two good weapons of decent quality, so. Let's see here. Hmm. 
give one to Etna and one to I don't know, I guess. Yeah. And buy a bunch more slippers. Let's see here. Myself to have more move. Oh. Oh. Slippers don't raise your move. <laughs> well, dang it. I've been buying slippers for basically nothing. Well, I guess they do raise jump a little bit, but that isn't exactly meaningful. Alright, whatever. Not buying slippers then. Could also buy some armor, but... Eh, I'm more confident in my tactics than that. <laughs> Let's see how the dojo is doing. Eventually, as you fight battles, these uh, these bars are gonna fill in, and we'll get a get a bonus to our things. Doesn't seem to be happening right now, though. So let's just get going. The Frozen River—it's a repeat of Disgaea One. Let's go, unmoving land. Doesn't look quite as bad as a uh, sealed off area in the first game. The one that very what? nearly foiled my Laharl solo run. Sicily is surrounded by demons. This doesn't look good for her. That's true, but something doesn't seem right. Hmm. Who cares? I'm going to catch her. You just get out of the way for her. It's the self-proclaimed overlord from earlier. You caught up to me already? <laughs> you thought you could get away? Wait a minute. I'm not the self-proclaimed overlord. I am the absolute one and only overlord. But all these demons say they don't know who you are. Thought they were an autonomous collective. <laughs> Took a while for me to remember the line. Really? All those statues were for nothing? Damn you! Fine! Then I will engrave into your rotten brain. Hey, that's racist. I don't see any zombies around here. Alright, so, slimes. Decrease non-elemental damage taken by 75%. So yeah, uh, use magic against these guys if you don't want to have a bad time. <laughs> Let's see, the male magicians, uh, we already have one of those, they have magic bundle. Light salvation, these are priests. Uh, they heal themselves at the same time they are healing another unit. They have books for some reason. But that's fine. Oh yeah, I never did check uh, what Flan's ability, what the effect of that was. <laughs> when we were fighting uh, Grosso. Oh well. get started and just uh, kind of thrash these clowns. Yeah, they've got negative elemental affinities, which is good for us. Alright, that's two of the slimes taken care of. Get some of our beefier units out here to uh, protect these guys in case uh, anything. Oh, hi. <laughs> Etna still wants to be the overlord. 
You're not exactly tanky, uh... Yeah, neither is Rosa. Oh well. That ain't gonna stop us. And let's get Stella over here. Now that we know uh, thieves can actually steal without an item... Uh, there's no reason not just to take everything that isn't nailed down. I mean, look at this. These guys got some uh, high-tier armor we can use. Well, relatively high-tier. And also snipe them from afar. <laughs> it's pretty great. Here. Uh, Stella needs to get out of the way. But actually, uh, combo correction, damage plus 10%. That's a thing that you get when you attack multiple times while standing still. Uh, we can kind of see that it didn't quite do enough damage to kill that one, but that's fine. There's still a little bit of randomness in the damage formula. Let's see... Man, that won't help me. Oh, these will particularly help. I think it's better just to take the slow path. By that, I mean defending ev anyone and everyone. I don't think these guys quite have what it takes to uh, heal the other guys. Probably should have had our magic users over here to tank for us. Oh well. Hmm. Harl is kind of uh, wide open if he's not defending, so let's do that. These slimes just uh, don't want us to catch up with them. Can I reach with Bomber Dude? I can't. Ooh, we can kill this one. Trick. Bang! <laughs> How's that? I'd say that was pretty good, Stella. Level 8 already. Not bad. Yes, sir, yeah. dude, dude. Can't quite reach with wind, but we can with Bomber Dude. Boom, that's one healer taken down. Yeah, seriously, where are these slimes going? Alright, well, let's, uh... Ooh, actually, uh... You need healing again, Rosa. Oh, really? Etna has the highest res? Alright. Maybe it comes from her uh, spear. I could possibly believe that. They are defensive uh, oriented weapons. Might as well throw Etna just to, to get her in on a team attack eventually. Yes, sir, dude. Let's see. 
Target height problem, okay. Will wind reach? Uh, wind will not reach anybody, but it will reach the chest. That's pretty good. Yeah, you can see Eddie here is taking very minimal damage from our gun because it's non-elemental. There we go, team attack. What's in the chest? Experience. That's nice. Flan has learned Espoir. Espoir is a healing spell that cures all status ailments. Very nice. Oh dear, uh, we got a KO. That was Etna. Do that, uh... Harl, I guess you can heal Rosa again. I'm gonna do it. I'm doing it. You thank me. And I don't know, uh... Yeah, sure, why not? Bam! You're a great help. Alright, we got some stuff, and I forgot to steal from anybody. Oh well. We can now make a green slime, because we have killed a green slime. It's pretty great. Alright, let's see. Ooh, we can get some new stuff. For healing 800 HP total, we get a legendary Kung Fu Muscle. For healing 400 SP total, we get a legendary Psycho Orb. And for reviving 5 units, we get a legendary Caterpillar Egg. For doing cool stuff, we get a legendary Imperial Seal, which raises all stats. Well, all of the primary stats, anyway. So yeah, our, uh, our hospital progress is coming along nicely. Let's see, who can we equip with what? Let's see, Etna, you're the one with the spear, so you take the safety helmet. Guess I'll also give you this armor. Um, uh, yeah. Yeah, I think that'll be fine for now. I guess we'll give Etna the extra amulet. Let's see... No, I'm saving my mana on home run for uh, something a bit better. Let's see if we can pass a more expensive stuff bill. Today's chairman is Pingu! Yes, sir, dude. Die, dude. Let's see, what does that mean? Chairman effect, threaten. He already has total support, that's good. Let's see. Either way, either way, either way. It doesn't look like any of these guys uh, hate us, per se. So you, yeah, yeah. All right, we'll start with the level 90 guys, and drunk senators uh, will have a chance of not recognizing the item they are given. Uh, that means they might hate an I their preferred item and like their non-preferred items. You can sober them up with medicine. Let's see. Liked item. Armor. Okay. But we don't have any armor to spare. I'm actually not too keen on... Let's see. Monster weapons. We got those. Uh, 
All right, strongly four. Let's see, they like stealing hands. That's fine, we have a thief now. We can afford to use them, but we don't have any. You like orbs, and I'm not too keen on giving you this legendary orb. You, I don't exactly want to give you anything, so, uh... Guess that's it for our uh, bribery. Wow! <laughs> newt new. That's what I have to say. Uh, so yeah, we got a stronger assembly or a stronger items bills bill passed. That means we can buy some better, even better items in the shop. If we could afford them. So yeah, I will see you in the character demo. The class of the day is the, uh, not you. The warrior. These guys are available from the start of the game. Uh, like most early game units, they unlock new tiers at levels 10, 20, 40, 80, and 160. Warriors are very uh, up close and in your face fighters. My uber trained body. As you can see, uh, Jerry is uh, has a extraordinarily high stats. That's because he is a unit I captured from the Land of Carnage item world. But you can see his uh, aptitudes and weapon stats are about what you'd expect. Uh, these guys are normal. <laughs> normal warriors. Uh, you can see their stats all up in here. Uh, you can also see that they're... Uh, Yeah, you can also see that their uh, weapon uh, masteries have gone up a bit here. Uh, their natural weapon affinities are Fist C, Sword B or A at rank 5, uh, Spear B, A at rank 5, Bow C, Gun E, D at rank 5, Axe B, A at rank 5, Staff E, Book E. Okay. As for their abilities, whoops. Alright, we have Wild Cry, which increases stats by 15% per enemy unit within two panels. So, you can definitely march these guys right into the fray. They will uh, be just fine. It's their older twin's birthday. <laughs> Shaking excitement. Kind of like Mal's uh, violent courage way back in Disguise 3. Increased stats by 3% per enemy unit on the map. So a wider range than uh, than Wild Cry, but uh, less powerful. There aren't a lot of enemies, anyway. And Fortitude, which is different. Uh, it protects you from one-hit kills. Kind of like uh, the ability Sturdy in Pokemon. That's all there really is to say, but uh, what say we let Jerry take out some of these guys? You're overmatched. He doesn't have any axe skills because uh, he's a freshly captured dude. <laughs> oh well. I just gave him what I could. Yay! And that's all she wrote.